Hey guys, here with Chaos Theory. This is an Arovar deck up against Nerith Hub. Not sure if that's a kill deck or not. Um, I've seen it go both ways on the mall into kind of a weird one that's not very good. We had the Astrolabe, but unfortunately we've already missed two remotes. Well, that's a pretty good draw. So double Artist Colony, not what you want to see. Fansite's all right though. And he's running Sensi on us already. Yikes. I mean, the good news is if he spams too many remotes, we'll get a bunch of cards drawn. But, yeah, we'll see. We should probably check one of these. There's probably, there could well be a naked Astro. Oh, okay. Wow, nine cards in hand. So he wants us to not run this turn. So six is a non-agenda. I bet four or five is an agenda. I'm gonna check four. Jeez, oh. Well, if he scores in server five, we'll at least get two fan sites. Then we can artist colony our au revoirs and start making a bunch of money. It's the general idea. I didn't res Jeeves here because he can do three installs and do another thing. Huh. What's all this stuff? I don't know what this is. I don't know what his deck is right now. A little confused. Is there a naked astro hiding somewhere here, or is it just like spam all the remotes? Jackson. Maybe he's going for hardening news. Okay, there's a sand sand. So he's looking to score next turn, presumably. I guess we have to trash Sensi. Don't really want to. Should probably pop Typer Driver this turn. Because I do somewhat want to play some of these cards out. I guess the main one I want is the Artist Colony. I don't love that snowball. It's expensive. I'm going to, I think, pitch it and we'll ship it if we actually need it, which we may not. And this costs too much right now. So we'll let him score here. We've got a pretty good clot lock with between the artist colony search for clot and the double sacon. So I think we can afford to let Sand Sand live. Oh, the one, the one we didn't check was an agenda. Nice. It was the Astro. What? <laughs> That's really too bad. Did we, did we check every other card? Because there's Sand Sand, there's Jackson. No, maybe we didn't check that one. Well, that's too bad. Got our turning wheel, got our snitch. We can start building up counters. Um, he's on two creds. Okay, so we got it. We got one au revoir. That's pretty good. Let's get these next au revoir. 
let's get the third au revoir. So we'll go get three credits. I've got our mega opus. Now we can afford to turning wheel. Check out what R&D is. Wrap around, good to know. Did it work? I'm out of the run. I think it kind of bugged. Let's hit close prompt. All right, we'll go back to three. Uh, we'll try HQ, which is vanilla. So actually, we're going to want our snowball eventually. But for now, we'll get our city hall down. This will let us dodge breaking news tags, keep our turning wheel alive. We just need to really not lose this turning wheel at any er, at any time. And we can actually just dig most of his R&D out. I like the sponsorship assembly lines. It's a lot of influence, but you can get it back, turn it into turn it into real money right away, get another install. And then it's always going to be here to have a good use of sponsorship. So I quite like that. Are there any cards you want out of our deck in particular? So I'm trying to think of even playing diesel's worth it. I guess we want to get our clot. That's the main thing we want. So we could pump five to try to find SMC or clot. We get our SMC, that's good. Do we have leprechaun? No, but we can get it. So we'll go R&D, jack out. Now we can get Leprechaun if we want to, or just slam chip down. I kind of want most of these cards, so I think we're going to install the best one, which would be chip. Chip is good, yeah. So really, Gamble is going to say not as good as just running with an Au Revoir. We might... Oh, we shouldn't need the City Hall. This one shouldn't die. We shouldn't steal until we get everything and win the game that way. I want the Driver. I want the Sakon. I think I want the... I think I don't need the Fan Sight. Might not need Gordian Blade at any point. All right, so we got our four creds to stop breaking news. He still gets to run Sensi. So we can bottom a lot of agendas. We'll, we will we'll want to get like a ton of counters if possible. Just naked agenda it. Yeah, we can't check everything, right? Like it's, if he's putting three at a, at a time, we can't do anything. Oh wow. What's that now? He's not always oh, scoring it. Okay. License acquisition, like a boss. Free sand sand seems legit. All the cards. They really need to have a better way to, to show these. Like if you can stack them into like a second or third row, it'd be so much easier. It used to be at Octagon, you could just drag them around wherever you wanted. So you'd just be able to like stack your two team spotter ships on top of each other, do all that stuff. It was a better way than this like zoom out nonsense. 
because here like the the log is not pinned to the side so it ends up scrolling off and that's no good there's a lot of issues with this interface Wow, so here we are. And he's done a lot of things. Still don't have our Claude. But I'd rather SMC for Leprechaun if possible. Okay, we'll, we'll ignore what he's doing. I don't, I don't think we can race in any meaningful fashion. we can do is get leprechaun out host one here whoops I think I misclicked that I think it's here we go we have one MU free see what I want is to have both of them down but I don't know that I can do it and because I need to get SMC from my clot so I think I just need to not do that right now we smash Sensi. Then we're at three credits. It's a no-go, so we'll go to R&D again. I want the film critic. I guess we might if he puts an agenda and we have to steal it. Oh geez, can he score through the clot? Maybe you can. Maybe we should have played the sacrificial construct because he has the Jeeves and the Sanson and the Astro token. Yeah, I think we miscounted here. I think he has enough power to go two agendas at once, like Beal Beal. Probably one of these is a cyber decks. Thing is like. It really sucks running remotes for no benefit except to check them. If he installs through most a turn, he's just getting ahead of us and we're doing nothing. So you have to let some of them go, but then it happens that the one you don't check can be Astro. There's a lot of... Um... A lot of randomness on whether you check the Astro or not. This one Astro that's still left in the game is very strong. Yeah, we should have probably played it safe. Put the sack on down. Instead of doing this uh, last run. The team would install the agenda. He's got one more click left. Well, how doesn't this work? He installs the agenda, he advances, uses the Astro token. That seems like a win to me. I think I think we had this if we played better. This is a very click intensive thing, right? And wait, that's only six points, right? I guess I have to, right?
Wait, that's a uh, one pointer. Doesn't have a six another agenda. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. Yep. So we got to play our sack on. That's what we got to do. Really just a misplay on our part. Thanks for watching, guys.